Hello, welcome. In this video, I'm going to show you some of the details of this very easy, simple to build birdhouse. And I'm also going to show you five different ways to create an access door so you can access or clean out your birdhouse. And probably the very first step I'm going to mention is so I'm building this one. It's, you might be tempted initially to um, create that nice little point up here at the very top. So um, you get a nice straight point there with the two pieces of wood meat. But what you're going to find in order to do that, you're going to need either a table saw, a band saw, or a miter saw that does 60 degrees. And that's going to be very difficult. I've never seen one. Typically they only go to 45 degrees. However, if you uh, take this approach, you can see this one's just a little bit smaller, this one's a little bit longer, then I can get by with just some very simple 30 degree cuts. And I'll put all the details on the website. Okay, as far as uh, access doors, in this case here, I've just got some uh, wing nuts right here, so it makes it very easy to access it. I can then remove this piece of wood and easily access or clean out the birdhouse there. Well, what are these things right here? They're these screw bolt combinations, so half of it is threads for going into wood, and the other half are going to be uh, threads for holding my wing nuts there. So that's one easy approach there, and I could show you on this one here uh, to remove screws, but I've already got another one really handy right here. Here's another easy approach to um, access or clean out your birdhouse. Just simply make one of the pieces fasten it, making sure you use screws. So in this case, I'm going to go ahead and simply remove some screws here, at which point I can easily access and clean that. The only thing I probably should mention there is anytime I do an access door, I'll either put it on the sides or on the roof, but I never place it on the bottom so that if there is any type of failure there, um, nothing disastrous happens there. Okay, let's uh, that's two different ways. Let's look at uh, three more ways that you can uh, add some access doors. And this is just a uh, piece of wood here. Um, another easy approach here, this takes a little bit more time there, is to um, create, just to add a hinge. In this case here, very similar to what I just did there, is I'm going to have a piece of wood. And the next approach, or the last approach I'm going to show you is uh, using the cover from a metal junction box. And I probably should have begun with saying, initially you probably think, man, I need a great big access hole. In this case, this is a four inch hole. Or maybe you're thinking I need a three inch hole. I've got some fairly large hands. When I order gloves, I order size extra large. And even with extra large, I can still reach my hand in through a three inch access hole. And these uh, come in all different sizes. You can see this is a really small one. So if I had a birdhouse, say like this size right here, I could easily uh, drill a hole and place my little cover right here. In this case here, I've got a much larger cover from a metal junction box. But if you take a look at it, it's got a little slot at the bottom. At the top, it's got a bigger hole with a slot. So in this case here, I can simply place it. And I would probably tighten the screws up, but you can see, uh, again, you want to make sure that this is the top and that's the bottom, because if I flipped it, it would actually fall off. So we just simply uh, uh, you kind of go through the little bigger slot, slide it down, and tighten the screws up, and you're off to the races there. Okay, well hopefully in this video you should learn some of the details of this very easy to build. Again, I'll put all the directions, dimensions on the website, but I think you're going to find uh, it makes it a very easy way to add an access door with these screw bolt combinations. There. I'll catch you, catch you later. Uh, good luck building yours. Thanks, bye.